Thank you for your support and for watching Aviv Tarot. This is a general pick a card reading. Take what resonates with you and leave the rest behind. Not everything will apply. My readings are meant to be constructive and not destructive. I give readings to empower you. I will be honest in what I see and will not give you false hopes or empty promises in order to keep you happy. I will be compassionate and sensitive to your feelings and will not judge or condemn. Energies are ever-changing. You are still the master of your own destiny. Hello, hello. Hi, everyone. Thank you for watching Aviv Tarot. And today we are going to do another pick a car reading. In today's pick a car reading, we are going to take a look at timelines. Um, I want to put a little bit of a disclaimer at the beginning that um, personally, what I experienced with the timelines, it's not always going to be exact. It could be like a um, plus minus one to two months difference um because i actually it was a different deck that i used and i, I believe i might have like shared the story a while ago in different readings um but that was a particular deck that it could actually give you a timeline like a specific date okay and that date was off by like a month so not that it's off because I still think it's pretty accurate because um, I think the timeline that it, the date that it gives it gave me was December 24th or 25th or something like that. And the actual trip, because um, my question involves some uh, like traveling and the actual trip, like the day for the flight ticket was January. 26 i think that's when i arrived um but right after because you know the date that they give me was during christmas right after new year's when i went back to work my company told me that they're going to open uh this asian country um and and they're going to open up an office and so they're going to send me over there and so the trip didn't happen until the end of january but the news was already been uh, I received the news that I'm going to be sent over there like early January. So it really, I guess it, it wasn't really off by a month. It was off by a couple of weeks. Okay. So with that being said, um, I think timeline is going to be, you know, again, plus minus a month or so, maybe two, up to up to two months sometime. So whichever timeline I give you here. Um, don't take it too literally because it might be off by a little bit. Okay. Um, so now we're, <laughs> we're going to have 26 different options. Okay. 26 different options. Um, during the, um, what do you call it? The post-production, I am going to list all of the options right here. Okay. With A to Z. Okay. A to Z. You can pick any of the alphabets that you would like sometimes because because i'm doing the alphabets at the end so i don't have like little cards for each of the alphabets accidentally sometimes i do uh <laughs> read two alphabets at the same time and so if that is the case there is going to be a which alphabet one and alphabet two it's that's usually because i did, read it twice um, all right, so take um, think about the question that you want to ask that involves a timeline, like you want to ask about a time period, and you can pause the video so that you can really think about your question. We're going to do shuffling online, and um, if you have more than one question, I would recommend you to do it right now at the same time and pick the different options right now because i'm going the, the the timeline reading the shuffling and everything each of the piles is going to go through super quickly and i'm not going to also do my little um you know ending sent i what do you call those ending dialogue i guess about you know like subscribe and share and all that stuff so it's just gonna go th right through so with that said i'm going to say it now <laughs> take your pick um with the options think about the uh, um the questions that you want to ask and if you really like enjoy this um video don't forget to like share or subscribe to my channel enjoy my video and also you can leave in the comments section below if you have anything you would like to share with me or any other readings that you would like me to do and we will start with 
Option number A. Okay, so if you chose A, what is the timeline for you? Okay, timeline for A, the A group. A group. Ooh, Ace of Pentacles. Okay, so with the Aces, it represents all of the Earth elements. So this actually has three different months that's going to involve. It's all the Earth, um, the Earth signs, the Earth months, which um, is the Taurus season, Virgo season, as well as Capricorn season. And if you need the specific date, I am going to give you the specific date, which is uh, December 22nd to January 19th, that will be the Capricorn season. Taurus season will be April 21st to May 20th, okay? Um, that will be the Taurus season. And then the Virgo season is August 23rd to sub September 22nd, all right? So that will be for option A. All right, option B. What is your timeline? For your question timeline for option b timeline for option b okay we have two of swords um two of swords is um libra time which is from september 23rd to october 2nd it's a it's a smaller window okay september 23rd to october 2nd Again, like I said earlier, um, plus minus a couple weeks, right? Or up to two months. All right. Option C. Oh, option C. We got two of swords again. September 23rd to October 2nd. September 23rd to October 2nd. All right. Option D. If you chose D, what's your timeline? Option D, your timeline is the tower card the tower card is usually associated with mars so mars is the aries sign which is from march 21st to april 20th march 21st to april 20th okay that would be d e oh okay hold on a minute I need to say one more thing about D. D, the tower card. Um, it's also, it's Mars. So in the olden days, Mars also is the, the planet for, the ruling planet for Scorpio. So not just Aries, but also Scorpio. Um, so the, the timeline for this one, so besides the Aries, this is the Scorpio timeline, which is October 23rd to November 22nd. So it has two different months. The first one is March 21st to April 20th. And the second one is October 21st to November 22nd. So two. Take it how I resonate for you. Now, E. E is the sun. The sun is the Leo card. So the timeline is from July 22nd to April. August 22nd, July 22nd to August 22nd. F, if you chose F, what is your, oh, F is this chariot, which is the Cancer period. Um, that's from June 21st to July 21st, June 21st to July 21st. G. If you chose G, what's your timeline? G. G is the Four of Cups. Okay, Four of Cups um, is it's a smaller window because it's a minor arcana. July 12th to July 21st. July 12th to July 21st. Okay. G H. H, ooh, two of swords again. H, it's um, September 23rd to October 2nd. September 23rd to October 2nd. I, 
eye. You got the Page of Cups. Um, you know what? This is kind of interesting because you got the moon kind of too. Both of them are um, water signs. And Page of Cups actually is encompasses. So this is the Pisces um, card. But I always associate the moon with the Cancer as well. So I'm going to give you the Pisces and the Cancer period. So the Pisces period is from February 9th. 19th to March 20th February 19th to March 20th and the second one is the cancer because it's the moon um, June 21st to July 21st June 21st to July 21st the page of cups is um, all of the water elements okay all of the water elements so um, since I already gave you the two water elements here um, I'm going to give you the Scorpio element uh, the timeline as well which is uh, from October 23rd to November 22nd, October 23rd to November 22nd. All of the pages has an earth quality as well. And so I'm going to give you the earth sign time. So you're going to get six months, but especially during the Pisces season and the Cancer season, that would be the um, most likely that's going to occur. But then um, there's the Scorpio timeline, the Scorpio month as well. And then also I'm going to give you all the Earth months, which is Taurus is from April 21st to May 22nd. Virgo is August 23rd to September 22nd. And then the, the Capricorn time, which is December 22nd to January 19th. So those six months is also a possibility, but it's going to be a strong Pisces or Cancer time. Most likely it's going to happen during that time, but... All the other the other four months as well okay J okay J option J Ooh, okay nine of Pentacles nine of Pentacles it's going to be September 2nd to 11th September 2nd to 11th all right j k k option k k what's the uh, timeline for option k okay ten of wands Ten of Wands, the timeline is from December 13th to the 21st. December 13th to the 21st. Okay. L. All right. Two cards. I'll take both. Wow. Virgo is going to be a strong Virgo time. Okay. Strong Virgo time. This is all of the Earth signs. Uh, Earth times. So, um, Taurus. April 21st to May 20th, April 21st, May 20th, strong Virgo, because this one is a Virgo um, timeline as well. So August 23rd, August 23rd to September 22nd, August 23rd to September 22nd. And then the Earth um, sign, there's one more that's from December 22nd to January 19th, December 22nd to January 19th. Okay. M. M. M is the moon, which is the Pisces season, which is from February 19th to March 20th. February 19th to March 20th. N. And we have two and we have two timelines. So um, the first one is to uh, four of cups, which is um, July 12th to 21st, July 12th to July 21st. And then the nine of swords is Jan uh, June 1st to June 10th. OK, June 1st to June 10th. OK. N O O O 
option O. What's the timeline for option O? Too many. Option for option, timeline for option O. Okay, we got that one. Option O is three of wands. Three of wands is from March 31st to April 10th. March 31st, for, uh, blah, blah, blah. March 31st to April 10th. Okay. P. P, what's the timeline for P? Timeline for P. What's the timeline for P? P is the judgment. Um, Pluto, which is Scorpio time. Okay, Scorpio time. So that would be October 23rd to November 22nd. October 23rd to November 22nd. P, Q. Q is Six of Wands. Six of Wands is August uh, 2nd to August 11th. August 2nd to August 11th. R. R, we got the Nine of Wands, which is December 3rd to December 12th. December 3rd to December 12th. S. S is Page of Pentacles, which is all of the Earth signs, okay? All of the Earth signs, which includes April 20, uh, Taurus, April 21st to uh, May 20th, April 21st to May 20th. And then the Virgo time, which is August 23rd to September 22nd, August 23rd to September 22nd. And then the Capricorn time, which is December 22nd to January 19th. December 22nd to January 19th. T. What's the timeline for T? Option T. T is the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands is all of the fire, sign, uh, fire signs as well as the water signs. So I'm going to give you six different months. And so it's gonna occur in any of these six months. First water, uh, let's do first fire sign Aries, which is March 21st to April 20th, March 21st to April 20th. And then the first water sign is June 21st to July 21st, June 21st to July 21st. And then the next um, fire sign, which is July 21st, 2nd to August 22nd, July 22nd to August 22nd, and then the next water sign, which is October 23rd to November 22nd, October 23rd to November 22nd, the next uh, fire <clears throat> period is from November 23rd to December 21st, November 23rd to December 21st, and then the last water time is February 19th to March 20th, February 19th to March 20th. You? You? What's the timeline for you? Okay. Um, Ten of Pentacles. That will be from September 12th to 22nd. September 12th to September 22nd. V? V? Ooh, it's Page of Pentacles again. The Earth Time. Earth sign time, which is Taurus, April 21st to May 20th, April 21st to May 20th. The next Earth time is August 23rd to September 22nd, August 23rd to September 22nd. The last one is Capricorn time, which is December 22nd to January 19th, December 22nd to January 19th. W. W is seven of wands seven of wands is august 12th to august 22nd august 12th to august 22nd x x 
option X. That's the timeline for option X. King of Cups, I'm going to give you six different timeline because uh, Cups, the water signs, as well as all of the Kings has the air sign as well. Okay, so Cups, so the water and the air sign. So the first air sign is May 21st to June 20th. May 21st to June 20th. The second, uh, the first water sign is uh, June 21st to July 21st, June 21st to July 21st. The next air sign is September 23rd to October 22nd, September 23rd to October 22nd. The next water sign is October 23rd to November 22nd, October 23rd to November 22nd. And then the next air sign is uh, January 20th to February 18th. Jan um, January 20th to February 18th, and then the last water sign is February 19th to the 28th. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, sorry. February 19th to March 20th. February 19th to March 20th. So that's all six months there for you, the timeline. Why? If you chose option Y, your timeline is. Y, the Y timeline. Okay, the magician, which is the Mercury sign. So I'm going to give you the Gemini and the Virgo timeline. The first one is the Gemini timeline, which is from May 21st to uh, June 20th, May 21st to June 20th. And then the Virgo time, which is from August 23rd to September 22nd, August 23rd to September 22nd. Z, if you chose Z, what's your timeline? If you chose Z, what's your timeline? All right, I will take both. Ooh, look at this, there's a double eight. So eight might be significant as well for you. Maybe it's the eighth month, the eighth, the eighth day, okay? And the actual date date um, for swords, eight of swords would be uh, May 21st to May 31st, May 21st to May 31st. And then the eight of wands is uh, November 23rd to December 2nd, November 23rd to December 2nd. And that concludes our reading for today for all the timelines. And if you have anything you would like to share with me, you can leave it in the comment section below. And don't forget to like, share, or subscribe to my channel under my video and turn on that notification bell if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye.